Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody, let's update our view in the gold market. So yesterday uh, we said that market theoretically could show the bounce and show the retesting of the broken trend line. The AB shape, ABC shape, so we have said that probably it makes sense to at least move stops to the break even or maybe even book the half of the profit of the position. Usually when I have some doubts and have the profitable position, uh, I try to uh, close the half of it and keep the rest depending on what will happen next so because our task here is to make the result but not to catch the big swings so and uh, this is a reasonable compromise to uh, get the half of the position book the half of the profit and then see what will happen next but as you can see this insurance probably we, we haven't needed it so because this market uh, started keep dropping low so it has made minor attempt to move higher but uh, it was unsuccessful and the market keep going to the downside. Now on the daily chart, we're watching for the COP target, which around 16.85. So that's major direction based on our long term trading plans, based on the weekly chart and, and the weekly grubber. So that's where we are going. And uh, today probably we could get uh, another chance to take the position. For those of you who do not have the short position but would like to take it, it's because we have some data today, ADP report, PMI, lots of statistics on inflation in the European Union. So that could bring some volatility and maybe provide some interesting stops or trading. So on the four hour time, time frame chart, we have uh, important bearish signs. So first of all, uh, despite that we have the divergence and yesterday, actually, we, we suggest that maybe we will get this ABCD based on this morning star passion. So you can see this big passion. The only difference that we have two dojis on the bottom, usually it's single doji, but here we have two and two, two of them. But anyway, this is same action as the morning star. But take a look what has happened. Market has formed a grubber. This grubber has been erased. Actually, here we have two grubbers in a row. So both have been erased. And what is more important here is that market has erased this morning star. So it means that the pressure, bearish pressure on the gold right now stands more or less significant. This market keep going lower. And uh, actually, it also stands right now below the major support. So 7 to 19 and 29 is already has been broken. So now our nearest support will be the COP target, of this ABCD passion. It stands 7 to 15. It's nearest destination point where theoretical market could try to show some pullback, some retracement maybe. Uh, if this pullback happens, that provides the chance uh, for those of you who would like to take the short position. That's actually what we uh, could keep an eye on the gold market right there. In another important moment, take a look that we treat this line as a vital, and we said market has to stay below it to keep bearish context. And market has completed this condition, so it just retested it. Confidence resistance was there, and now stands below it. So everything from that standpoint stands great. Now let's take a look on the hourly chart. Here we have the falling wedge that's potentially bullish, but. In the modern markets, uh, fallen wages, which very often becomes the patterns that leads to downside acceleration. In the case of the downside breakout taken out of these lows, we of course hope that maybe based on the COP touching the 1750, we could get minor bounce. But I do not exclude the chance that we could get just straightforward downward acceleration. It is also possible. So, and if you would like to take the position, you could also consider uh, the using for example stop sell order below the cop if uh, acceleration happens you will just take position on the breakout and downward action here if everything will go on the classic scenario market completes the cop at 1715 then starts the pullback in this case you could watch for this probably more or less reliable level 1735 it will be confluence where theoretically our pullback on the cop might be over and market could re-establish downward action as well so that's approximately what we have on the gold. Those of you, of course, who already have the position and hold them for this break-even stops right there, 
just could do nothing, just uh, monitoring the overall situation, keep stops at the break-even. That's all.